That mystery at the Vatican. What happened to that 15-year-old daughter of a Vatican worker who vanished more than three decades ago? A tip led her family and authorities to a Vatican City property. And today, thousands of unmarked bones were recovered underground. ABC's Will Reeves at the Vatican. Tonight, new clues in the mysterious disappearance of a teenage Italian girl more than three decades after she vanished. Numero così enorme. A forensics expert saying thousands of bones found, perhaps belonging to dozens of people, all underneath a Vatican college. Those experts now working to determine if the bones could also include those of Emanuela Orlandi, who disappeared in 1983 at just 15. Orlandi's family believes the Vatican has not revealed everything it knows. Just days ago, acting on a tip, investigators opened the tomb of two German princesses, but found nothing. It was completely empty. But in the process, Vatican officials found remains nearby, perhaps moved during construction years ago. The big question tonight, whose bones are these? Orlandi family supporters vowing tonight they will not be satisfied until there are answers. Why is this important? The Vatican needs to make their files public. The truth needs to come out. The Vatican has long insisted it had nothing to do with the disappearance of Emanuela Orlandi, but if these bones turn out to be her, it faces a difficult task in explaining how they got there in an area off limits to the public. Tom? Will Reeve reporting from Vatican City tonight. Will, thank you. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.